what you want, yeah. We just chillin' by the wild wise, lemonade with the large fries. Yeah. Puff twice for the calm high, ayy, what you want, yeah. Big checks make the bank bounce, old school candy paint down. Bad chicks, they from down south, ayy, what you want, yeah. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel, BQ Quick Review. I'm your host, BQ. And today we are going to be doing a movie review of Mile 22. Now Mile 22 is uh, starring Mark Wahlberg and uh, it's about a top secret uh, CIA, CIA agent who has to transport this uh, guy who has valuable information in the asset to get out of this country and get to this plane. And I guess the, you know, it's uh, 20 mile, 20, 22 miles away. So I guess that's why it's called mile 22. And uh, yeah, there's some people that are trying to get this guy and they're trying to kill his team on the way there. And he's trying to fend this guy also while trying to fend his own team and get his team out of there. So yeah, it's a, it's a little uh, action movie kind of a uh, story and uh yeah Mark, Mark Wahlberg you know he plays his good part he's like you know a little cocky uh CIA agent you know he he knows his stuff and he knows what he's doing he feels like he everybody needs to listen to him because he's the most experienced one and he's been through this you know he he's very full of himself you can see that he's very full of himself but uh yeah, what this was this movie good? I thought it was all right. Uh, it did its job as an action movie. You know, it was action. It was uh, chase scenes. It was uh, fighting. It was shooting. You know, the typical thing you would see in a uh, action movie. Uh, I'd say like it wasn't nothing like crazy that stood out to me. Mark Wahlberg, he did his job. You know, being a cocky CIA agent that he is, and you know, he usually plays those parts where he's like a cocky asshole, and that's what he does in this movie. He's a cocky asshole, and he plays it well. He does it well, and uh, all the surrounding people and the surrounding actors, they do their parts well too. You know, it was just like um, I don't know for me. I, I'm not too. Uh, it takes a lot for action movies to really. Um, catch my attention and uh this one wasn't one that really caught my attention too crazy it was okay uh not nothing out of the ordinary for me uh it, even like with uh the ending you know the, the ending was was cool i guess but it's, it's like uh, yeah it's, i've seen it before I've seen it done here and there wasn't nothing crazy for me uh I liked it. I I liked the team members. You know, uh, I didn't. I didn't really feel drawn to many of the team members besides. Uh, uh, I gotta bring up this actor's name, but uh, yeah, it was one of the the, the other lead roles. One of the uh, girls. I'm gonna put them on screen and put their name because I'm always so forgetful of people's names and stuff. That's one of the things about me. If you tell me your name. I'm probably going to forget it in like 10 seconds, so yeah, uh, don't ever tell me your name and expect me to remember it. I, I kind of felt bad for her, you know, because, you know, she was doing these missions and she wanted to get out alive and she she, want, she was just worried about getting home and had her little family problems and with her uh, baby father and stuff, you know, you could tell it's like she, she just wanted to do this job and get home to her kids, you know, and uh, Matt Damon, I mean, Matt Damon, Mark Wahlberg. <laughs> I don't know why I get confused with those two. But, uh, yeah, he's just, like, about the mission. He wants to get his team there. And it's like, you do it this way. We're going to do it my way. And I know what I'm talking about. You can see he's just this cocky guy. But you can see also that he's a skilled guy because he's taking these guys down. He's doing this thing, you know, doing the, the thing that you expect most uh, um action pro protagonist to do if you want to call him a protagonist but yeah you know these guys are running and trying to get this guy over to this plane and stuff and people are coming at them people are just always coming at them and everybody for all of these movies for some reason uh when it comes to like the main characters and stuff they just always have bad aim <laughs> It aim is always so terrible, but uh, yeah, you gotta suspend your disbelief for action movies a lot of times. Uh, but yeah, this one was decent to me. It wasn't nothing crazy. 
uh, even the ending, maybe the ending might have uh, gave you guys a shocker, but for me, it was okay. You know, uh, let me, you guys let me know what you think about this movie, really. Let me know what you guys think, because I thought it was okay, and that's just me, because I'm not very uh, easily um, entertained by action movies. You know, I'm, I'm really not. Uh, so this one, I'm going to give a three out of five. I'm going to give it a 3 out of 5. In terms of just action movies itself, it was average for me. It wasn't nothing uh, crazy that I got from it. It wasn't bad, though. It did its job as an action movie. That's all it was. And, yeah, everybody acted their parts accordingly, and they did what they had to do. And, you know, it was, it was good. So, yeah. Let's get to the spoiler section. Okay, we are in the spoiler section, so now we can talk about all the little juicy stuff here and there. So yeah, uh, all these guys are chasing uh, Mark Wahlberg and his team and stuff. And, you know, the guy that they're protecting, it turns out, you know, they they don't trust this guy, you know. He's very skilled, too. He's a very skilled fighter and a very skilled guy, you know. So they think he's a double agent. You know, working for their team. But you go to the end, he gives them the codes and everything, and you find out this guy's a triple agent. He's a Russian. He's a Russian. He's working with them. He just played all of them. So, yeah, that was like the big uh, twist of the movie, I guess. And it was just like, I, I don't know if I'm just like very... Uh, I don't know, I just foresee things and I f think so easily. It was just like, I, I could tell that something wasn't right with him all the way to the end. But uh, so it wasn't that, I didn't get very shocked that, oh, this guy was a triple agent and all that. It, it wasn't crazy to me. Uh, it was just like, uh, I guess the big effect of it is that uh, Mark Warburg, like he didn't... Uh, he was so cocky and he thought he knew everything and it turns out this guy played him. He got played by somebody and it turns out he doesn't know everything that he think he knows. This guy just, he he got played for the first time by somebody and he, you know, he lost a lot of his team. And you could tell this really messed up. This messed with him and they, it messed with his ego. <laughs> it had made him reevaluate things and stuff, even towards the end when he's talking and having a conversation and stuff. You could tell, like, he's like, yo, I got, I got played, man. Like, I thought I knew everything and I got played. And, you know, that's the big thing in the movie, you know. With the action scenes, it's just like these guys are shooting and shooting and shooting. And then, like, I'm, I'm sure a lot of these guys, you know, are professionals and stuff. So I'm like, how are they, like missing how are they missing these guys like how are they not shooting these guys it just doesn't make any sense to me so uh it was just a normal action movie to me they, they, they had to get this guy from point a to point b they were car kit chases and shootings and stuff and it wasn't like something crazy like the action scenes didn't pick out to me like uh like how john wick's action scenes picked out for me uh those were really good acting uh action scenes and uh just like uh i don't know it's not i don't know what to say about this movie it, it's just like it wasn't bad like that's why i really want to hear you guys opinions about it because i i'm not i'm it takes a lot for me to really like action movies and this one didn't stick out for me it was just okay it was okay movie to watch it wasn't like, oh my gosh, you gotta watch Mile 22. No, it wasn't that. And it wasn't like, oh my gosh, this movie's so good. It was just an okay action movie. You want to put it on, go ahead and put it on. If you like action movies, like you're a really big fan of action movies, I'm sure you probably enjoyed this movie. I'm sure you did, uh, or maybe you didn't. But, yeah, that twist didn't, didn't do it for me. Uh, action scenes. Didn't really do it for me too much. They were okay. They're okay. And, uh, yeah, nothing really stick out. Just another action movie for me. That's my spoiler section. Uh, what did you think about the ending? What did you think about the, the chase? And I didn't think the villains were too much of a 
threat, if you want to call them villains. Uh, I didn't think the, the people chasing them, trying to kill his team, I didn't feel like they were, like, a huge... I don't know, I didn't get no, like, good presence from them. Like, they... I didn't get no... Like, they, they were just on there just to be killed by uh, Mark War Warburg's team. Like, it's just... I... I couldn't, I couldn't like really resonate with them. They were just there to die. <laughs> and I feel like movies should do that. They should just have this thing where, you know, you're just not fighting just nameless people. You want to see like that, that they have an agenda. Even the main boss guy, I didn't really care for him. Like you got to see, you got to kind of feel like you're, you understand their agenda and you get it. And I didn't get that from this movie. Or maybe I missed it. You guys can tell me uh, what did you think about it. Uh, three out of five for this one. It was average. And uh, I will see you guys in the next view review. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Put down in the comments what you want me to review next. Got to put those things down there so I can get them done. And I will get to them. Don't worry. It just, you know, I do be busy sometimes. But I, I don't forget about you guys. I'll never forget about you guys, okay? Uh, I'll see you guys in the next review. Mediocre, everybody wanna be a rapper. You ain't real, but you play a role. Most of y'all pretty decent actors. I don't real goons and they on the block. Hit a stain like they bleach your fabric. I'm a nice guy, but got a dark side. We could get it cracking like my